Connor? Tony? Low testosterone levels again? Is it that obvious? You're right though, I gotta test. 356 nanograms per deciliter. Lowest of my life. I don't I don't know what's wrong, but we need to fix this. Especially if you're gonna get a lady boy girlfriend, you're gonna need higher testosterone levels. They do like masculine men. I'm not looking very masculine right now, so all right, let's let's plan this out. We're gonna figure out how to raise my testosterone levels, because I really need it. Okay, Tony, so I am feeling like a little bitch. My testosterone levels, 356 nanograms per deciliter, extremely low. Used to be a thousand, right? Combination of maybe a 40 day fast, any new vegan diet, not living the fitness lifestyle anymore, and maybe just getting older, 356 nanograms per deciliter, which is not great. Not great at all, especially for a bodybuilder. So we need to do something about it. In fact, they're so low that I'm actually anemic now. That means an iron deficiency. Despite me eating 250% of my daily value worth of iron, daily, still anemic. So we believe that it's due to my low testosterone. So what are we gonna do? You used to live the fitness lifestyle where your diet was perfect, your training was perfect, and your entire life revolved around fitness, and that will increase testosterone. But the problem is that's very high maintenance, and as you get older and you have more responsibilities and your goals in life change, it's very hard to maintain that. Absolutely. And I'm anemic, even though I'm getting 250% of my daily value of iron per day in my diet, that's wild. And so we think that that's due to low testosterone levels. So this is a medical condition that we need to seriously solve. So, well, one thing that we can do, be around beautiful women that has been shown to increase your testosterone level. When you are visually aroused, visually stimulated, testosterone levels will increase. Talk more about that later. Also, we're gonna do some Prima Sati Yoga later in this video, which, I totally believe 100% can drastically boost testosterone levels. I'll talk about that more in the future. But of course, the primary thing that we're gonna do that is probably gonna have the biggest impact is I'm gonna start taking the Natty Plus stack. And the primary factor that's really gonna drive my testosterone levels up, probably Blue Ox and Black Ox, the combination of those two. So got my testosterone levels tested January 24th, really low. We decided what we we're gonna do, and now February 1st, we are starting the Natty Plus stack, but we're gonna hold off on the 3AD. Because 3AD can also boost testosterone levels, and we don't wanna conflate 3AD with Black Ox and Blue Ox. We wanna know what really had the biggest impact, so we're gonna wait to do 3AD. That's gonna be phase two. But let's just take a look right now what my physique looks like at the current testosterone levels, and then we're gonna go about 10 days or so, look at what my physique looks like then, and we're gonna get my testosterone levels retested, see what they are, and hopefully they're significantly better. Oh, didn't see you guys there. Anyway, okay, we are at Muscle Factory in Bangkok, Thailand, and I am on a quest to boost my low testosterone levels. So, I had a brilliant epiphany. I read this one study that showed that visual erotic stimulation increases your testosterone by 35% for up to 90 minutes after that stimulation. And I thought, wow, so if I'm visually stimulated throughout the day consistently, I have the potential to boost my testosterone levels by like a couple nano, couple hundred, by a couple hundred nanograms per deciliter, which is actually extremely significant. So the more turned on I am throughout the day, the higher my testosterone levels will be. And then I thought, okay, what turns me on? Couldn't find any ladyboys on such short notice, but I did find Nita. So Nita is gonna help me boost my testosterone levels. We're gonna be doing some fun exercises that are gonna really get me in the mood and have my testosterone levels really high for this workout. So your job, okay, so the more turned on I am, the more horny I get, higher testosterone level, okay? okay. So you help me, you you make me you make me turned on. Oh, yes. Oh, give me extra motivation, extra energy. Oh, one more time, yeah. Oh yes. Oh. oh one more time. Yes. Oh, I love it. Oh, oh. I work out. Oh, that yeah. makes sense. Yeah. And then it boosts my testosterone levels and I get bigger. And you like you like big muscles, right? You like the big muscles? Oh. Wow. Oh yeah. yeah, big muscle. Yeah. All right.
right, Tony. So one thing that we've been doing during this journey to boost my testosterone levels is Prima Sati Yoga. Now, most people will just look at Prima Sati Yoga and say, uh, okay, that's bullshit or it's just some weird sexual thing. It is a sexual thing. It can be, it doesn't have to be. I've done it in a non-sexual way, but because it is erotically stimulating, it will boost testosterone levels for up to a couple hours after you engage in Prima Sati Yoga. If you're doing that every few hours of the day, you could significantly boost your testosterone levels. Like actually probably by a little bit. It's, it's not nothing, right? But also not only is it erotically stimulating, it's a meditative practice. So it calms you down. It gets you in the present moment. It reduces stress, which will reduce cortisol levels, thereby increasing testosterone levels. So I actually do think it's quite magical. Is it as powerful in blue ox, black ox? Probably not, but I believe it does something. So you've tried Prima Sati Yoga with Tony. How did that go? Did you like it? Yeah, I like it. At first it was a little awkward, right? But then you really got into it. You felt that connection with him. Yeah. Probably boosted her testosterone levels too. Very possibly. Cause you've been working out so hard in the gym. That's probably because your testosterone levels are increased. Like when your testosterone levels are higher, effort feels good. And you're like really enjoying going to the, going to the gym. Yep. That might be because of Prima Sati Yoga or because of all the SARMs Tony is feeding her. I don't know, <laughs> one or the other. <laughs>
that it did not decrease testosterone levels. It even sometimes increased testosterone levels, but he's gonna get blood work before and after adding three day D to the Natty Plus stack. And then you'll be able to see whether or not it affected your testosterone levels positively or negatively. Yeah, but this scene actually perfectly in encapsulates my testosterone boosting journey. I feel like a pioneer back in the old days before the testosterone levels started declining. So I think that that's a nice synchronicity why we're here. You know what you're pio nice you know you pioneering here yeah. is that people say that natural testosterone boosters don't work, which can be true if you already have naturally high testosterone. Right. If your testosterone level is already a 900 and you take natural testosterone boosters, you might go to a thousand. And that's not a significant increase that you would notice a big difference. But if your natural testosterone levels are 300 and you double your testosterone, it makes a huge difference. It's extremely significant, and nobody can say that super effective natural testosterone boosters like Black Ox, Blue Ox, you can't say they don't work because if you have low testosterone and use them like you did, then you end up with natural high testosterone levels, and you can feel that difference. Yeah, I was always very skeptical of natural testosterone boosters. I figured that they worked, but maybe, you know, only like a 10% difference or something like that. But wow, so this absolutely blew my mind. We also Double. didn't, we also did, needed to troubleshoot what was wrong with your testosterone levels. So if this didn't work, then we knew there was something else that we would have to fix. But this has worked in almost all, every blood test we've ever done on people has shown someone with low testosterone massively increasing their testosterone. So I was pretty confident it would work. Again, if it didn't work, we would troubleshoot a different pathway or, uh, or a new, another cause of why your testosterone was low. You like the cock? Yeah, you like my cock, don't you? Yes, I wonder if it's a clean cock or if it's a dirty cock that I would get a disease from. Pet the cock? You wanna stroke the cock gently? Pet the cock. Gently stroke the cock? Pet the cock. Pet it like you mean it. Yeah. <laughs>